dealer finance office sends your loan application out to many different lenders, which the dealership has relationships with. It usually only takes a few minutes because these lenders are available on demand after a loan application is loaded in the system. It's as simple as checking a box on the computer for the lenders they want to consider your loan. There are several reasons why the car dealer uses the shotgun method, and not all of them are good. Here are the perceived good things that come out of this. Number one, competition. Different lenders are competing for the loan. In some cases, sending a deal to multiple banks can greatly benefit the car buyer because the finance office now has options and can propose the best interest rate and loan term. Number two, a level playing field. In some cases, particularly with challenge credit, the shotgun approach can limit the number of declined applications other lenders see and increase the odds that the finance office secures the loan for the car buyer. Number three, better loan to value ratio. Lenders propose a LTV or loan to value percentage along with interest rates. A high loan to value ratio from one of the lenders can reduce your down payment or allow you to get other accessories you wanted. This opens the door to options that you can add to your loan without out of pocket cash. Number four, faster service. Some lenders respond faster than others. If one bank comes through with acceptable terms right away, it means you can be on the road much faster. That was the good news. Shotgunning can also do harm to a car buyer. Here's how. Number one, it can prevent you from doing business elsewhere. A dealer finance man sending out too many apps can hurt you if you decide to go to another dealer. Banks don't like to see multiple deals coming across their desk from the same customer, and it can cause them to decline you at every dealer you shopped. What's worse is that some finance officers actually use the shotgun technique for this very purpose, either to force you to come back or to spite you for saying no to their deal. Of course, this is illegal, but there are some serious jerks in some of these dealer finance offices. Number two, you can get set up. Dealers aren't always shopping for a better finance deal for you. Many use the shotgun technique to shop for better options for themselves. Remember that high LTV, the loan to value ratio? If they find a lender willing to borrow you 120% of the value of the car, they can pack in all those lovely products into the deal and then make it sound like they did you a favor or they tell you the bank wants you to have this stuff for the rates they quoted. Either way, it's purely greed and selfishness that drives this. It is commonly believed that if a dealer sends your car loan out to multiple banks, it does serious damage to your credit. That is generally not true. According to Experian and other major credit companies, they look at the types of loans applied for within a 14-day period and regard them as one application. However, if you're shopping around at multiple deals over a period of more than two weeks and you do credit applications at all of them, you could see a dip in your credit score. Some consumers report a loss of 40 to 50 points from a few weeks of car shopping without a purchase. How can you avoid the problems of shotgun financing altogether? It's easy. Get pre-approved for a car loan from your own bank or credit union and then don't fill out any finance applications at the dealership. Your bank or credit union approval will only count as one credit pool and you'll see minimal effects. If you learned something today about shotgun financing, please give us a like on the video. If you have any questions or comments or appreciate our work on your behalf, leave us a comment below in the video. We check back frequently and we'll be glad to provide you with feedback or assistance. Make sure you check out our other videos around car shopping and remember to subscribe for updates. I'm Kevin Hunter. Thanks for watching.